These are the three bats. They're the Rodriguez flying foxes, also known as the Rodriguez fruit bats. Most people, when they think of bats, they think of the very small, sometimes kind of ugly insectivorous bats. And flying foxes are fruit bats. Um, and they actually look like little foxes. They have really adorable faces. Amy Cutting is an animal curator at the Oregon Zoo. And she's not wrong. They do have a certain cuteness about them. These three were born at the zoo over the last couple of months. Bat births happen periodically at the zoo, but we've had three just in the last month, which is a pretty high number for us. Um, and so we're really excited about that productivity. Amy says all three bats are thriving, but sadly the mother of one recently passed away. We've had to take over raising her. They have a pretty extended neonatal period, so um, the keepers are currently hand feeding her. These bats are native to Rodriguez Island, which is a small island about 900 miles off the coast of Madagascar in the Indian Ocean. It is home to 20,000 of these bats. There was a time in the 1970s that there had been so much deforestation on the one island that they live on um, that their numbers were way down and then they got hit by a cyclone and they would think they were down to as few as like 100 bats. Now that number has been increasing. The zoo community came together to try to help um, breed those bats um, and and create a larger population and help repopulate that island. So now they're up in the thousands again. You're going to have to wait a bit to see these bats in person because the bat cave isn't open to the public right now. Unfortunately, the, the bat cave is not on our COVID route, our one-way safety route. So we just want people to know that we're, we're taking great care of them. In the meantime, the zoo will be working on a name for the one they'll be spending the most time with for a while. The keepers are still talking about it. I've heard Tammy, I've heard Roxy. They haven't quite settled. Um, so we, we have fun trying to name it. Joe Ranieri, KGW News.